welcome you uh, on this very fine uh, Geneva morning to a series of presentations on uh, the rise in um, income inequality, uh, the rise in wealth inequality. So that's the, um, the theme of the meeting that uh, brings us today together here in uh, Geneva. Um, I would like uh, very much to uh, thank um, ILO for uh, hosting uh, this event and also for the uh, participation of um, UNCTAD. Uh, we uh, and myself are from uh, WIDA in Helsinki. Uh, WIDA has uh, quite a long name. It stands for the World Institute for Development Economics Research and it is part of the United Nations University. Uh, WIDA was um, created nearly 30 years ago. Uh, we celebrate our 30th anniversary in uh, 2015. Uh, the name WIDER itself actually comes from Amartya Sen. We owe Amartya uh, this wonderful name uh, because Amartya was on the founding mission of WIDER. And of course, uh, the issues of poverty, inequality, and human development have been in our DNA as a research institute for 30 years as indeed have these issues been of great concern to ILO and to UNCTAD. So today, uh, to discuss the issues, uh, we have um, a very uh, distinguished uh, panel. Uh, we have um, Isabel Ortiz. Uh, Isabel is Director of uh, Social Protection at uh, ILO. Uh, she was previously director of the Global Social Justice Program uh, in uh, Joe Stiglitz Initiative for uh, Policy Dialogue uh, at Columbia University. Uh, she was earlier an associate director of policy and strategy in UNICEF and uh, a senior advisor in uh, UNDESA. Um, to my right is Richard Kozel Wright. Uh, Richard is director of the uh, Globalization and Development Strategies Division in uh, UNCTAD. Uh, he's had extensive experience in the UN, both in New York and Geneva. Uh, Richard is uh, a Cambridge economist, uh, has published extensively, uh, including a book called The Resistible Rise of Market Fundamentalism, uh, which I think is an excellent uh, title with Paul Raymore. Uh, as well as other, other work. Um, and then on our very far right, although not far right politically, <laughs> uh, is our good friend Andrea Cornea. Andrea is a uh, professor at the University of Florence. Uh, he's been professor uh, of uh, development economics since uh, 2000. Um, he's held positions, visiting positions at several universities, including Clermont-Ferrand, Pavia, uh, Cambridge, uh, the European uh, University Institute, and Oxford. Um, Andrea has uh, many years of uh, UN experience. Uh, I first met Andrea in the 1980s when we were working on adjustment with the human face uh, with um, Francis Stewart and Richard Jolly. Uh, Andrea has also worked for CEPAL, uh, the UN uh, Economic Commission for Europe, and so forth. But I, I especially remember Andrea from 1995 to 1999, when he was director of WIDA and my boss, um, and when he uh, recruited me for the first time into WIDA, which has been a wonderful uh, experience for me um, ever since. I'm, by the way, um, uh, Deputy uh, Director and uh, Chief Economist of uh, WIDA. So, I think you'll agree that we have a very uh, good panel uh, today uh, to debate with you, and we would like your active engagement, uh, the issues around inequality. Uh, we'll have a series of presentations, first by Isabel, uh, then by Richard, and then by Andrea. Uh, Andrea will be very much um, speaking to uh, some of the results from his new book for WIDA, uh, which is on the uh, Latin American experience in inequality. It's 
over there um, as you came in the door. Okay, so without further ado, if I could uh, introduce Isabel. We are, by the way, um, in this modern age of technology, uh, videoing this uh, meeting and also will be tweeting it. So as you make your bold statements, um, they will be preserved for some posterity, at least. Okay, thank you. Thank you.